if we're totally honest, I think a lot of us struggle believing that God could do something great in our life. Maybe in someone else, maybe someone we know, someone we see on TV, maybe someone that we think is great, but maybe not in my life. And I got thinking, why? Why do we wrestle with insecurity? Uh, I think there's a couple reasons. Sometimes it's our past. We've had some bad experiences, we've made a lot of mistakes, and we allow those mistakes to define us, and we think, well, that's it, it's over for me. Or sometimes it's our current limitations. Um, and as I said at the top of the show, it's sometimes our comparisons. It's, we look at our current situation, we say like, I am not in a position to be used. But then there's even a worse one, and this is where we get hopeless. We look at the future and we say, it doesn't really matter anyway, this world is just an awful place, and who cares? But you see, all of these thoughts are wrong. They will hurt you and they will hurt others. In Ephesians 2.10, here's the truth, and someone I know needs to hear this right now. For you, yeah, I, I changed that word on purpose. You are God's handiwork, created in Christ Jesus to do good works, which God pre prepared in advance for you to do. I love that word workmanship because it means we are something that is being made. There was an Old uh, Testament prophet, his name was Jeremiah, and God shows him a potter's wheel. Have you ever seen uh, clay molded and shaped into a pot? It's a process. And in that process, yes, sometimes flaws are exposed. Sometimes it needs to be broken down and uh, to, to be remade. And sometimes it has to be put into a kiln to harden. That's all part of the process. And for the clay, which is just really dirt with water, to become something great, it must submit itself to the process. So the question isn't whether or not God wants to or will use you. He will. It's just rather, are you willing to submit to the process? Are you willing to get onto the potter's wheel? And I've learned it means you just have to jump in. You have to do it. You have to find needs and you have to fill them. And I know it's going to be hard. Look, when you're serving, when you put yourself out there, when you take a risk, yes, flaws are going to be exposed. And yes, you'll feel beaten up at times. And yes, sometimes you'll even want to quit. But if you persevere, you will see the reward of doing something that lasts for eternity. And when you get discouraged, and you will, remember that God used so many imperfect and flawed people to bring his story into the world. It's why we love the Bible heroes. So the question really isn't, can God use me? The question really is, am I willing to put myself in a position for God to use me? And that is a stepping stone into being who God has created you to be.